I gotta testify. Come up in the spot looking extra fly. For the day I die, I'ma touch the sky. Gotta testify. Come up in the spot looking extra fly. For the day I die. <laughs> Good morning vloggy vlog. Um, also, don't mind my TV. It's like this for the meantime because I watch while I'm like sitting on my chair um, because I don't have a couch yet, so there's no point like pointing it that way. Today, I am meeting a friend from uni. She happens to be in London, so we're going to go to Brick Lane, eat, shop, thrift, whatever. Um, just kind of like catch up. It's actually really foggy in the morning, but it kind of cleared up, so now that it's not raining anymore, we're gonna go to Brick Lane. Also, I want to show you guys what I did. I got like the generic Samba shoes and I added like some pins that I have that I never really like use and I thought it looks kind of cool. Um, this one I got other pins as well. So yeah, I accessorize my shoes as well whenever I can. But I really needed like a casual shoe for like kind of like everyday type of thing and I had to opt for this one. So outfit of the day. We've got my Jacquemus top underneath. And then I also have this kind of like thrifted little baseball tee. And then I just popped on this like purple mohair cardigan. And then I like how this is coming out. A little detail. Um, Telfar belt, pants, some baggy jeans. My hat, obviously. So we're gonna go ahead out and take you along. Like, like you can't tell me this doesn't look cute. Come on. My little reflection has been like my mirror for all my outfits because I don't have my mirror yet. A tornado flew around my room. Okay guys, I found this coat and it also comes in like this fuchsia color. Um, and I'm gonna try it. Southern California, much like Arizona. My eyes don't shed tears, but boy, actually shopping for a coat on Essence, but I couldn't really like find any ones that I actually like. And especially because I'm in London, I really needed like a good coat. I'm actually a very happy gal because I got the coat for like a really good price. And it was like a thrift store, I think. Like it was like one of like vintage um, shops, like vintage um, thrift shops. Today's actually a Sunday, so I'm gonna dedicate it to cleaning the apartment and organizing everything. I still really need to organize my room because it's still very messy and I have a lot of things piled up on top of my cupboard. I had a really great day. Um, I actually forgot to vlog, but when I was on the train um, about to meet my friend, this guy actually came up to me um, telling me that his girlfriend watches my videos religiously. If you're watching, girl, your boyfriend is a real one <laughs> because he literally came up to me just to get a picture for you. And then I think my friend took a video of me when um, I got stopped by like this like photographer. They came up to me, took a couple pictures of my outfit. I'm really happy to be here if you can't tell already, but I'm gonna show you guys my coat purchases. Funny enough, I actually wanted like some good new coats for, you know, like London's like a little bit colder, so I don't really need puffers, but I do have puffers. I really am turning into like a coat person, especially during the winter time. I love like a good colored coat, a good long coat. It can't be like a medium cut coat. It has to be all the way down to the ground. Um, so I love how I got like such a good deal with these coats and they're like literally up my alley. I mean, if this doesn't scream my name, what will? I don't know if it's wool. It's like fuchsia pink caught my eye. I really was only planning on getting one, but I had to get both because I love color coordinating my outfits. I love color blocking, so I feel like any type of color, I'll be able to work it into my outfit. Let me show you. Come on. Exactly the coat that I wanted. Very kind of baggy. I love baggy coats. It has like two big pockets. Um, I really don't like a lot of like layers when it comes to coats. Like I want it fairly simple, you know, just like a 
throw on coat. And then, oh, I'm tired. And then I also got this like Bottega green color, which you guys know I've been kind of obsessed with. You can see like both of them will look good with this outfit. It's just a matter of what you want the outfit to kind of look like. So yeah. up a pair of airpods i don't like bringing the big headphones like everywhere i go so and i left my airpods at home so i've been using like my wire headphones um whenever i go out so that it's like nice and compact wearing the grinch shoes <laughs> actually i haven't worn this in a long time but keys ew why did i do this to my hair see i tried like a wet pony look but I think it's not wet enough and I didn't put enough gel. Or maybe my gel wasn't strong enough, so it looks like a wet dog tail. As you may be able to tell by my 
surroundings. We are gonna start organizing my fridge and pantry. So I have all these containers ready to be filled up. So we've got some rice. I also wanna put my cereal. So we've got cereal. We've got my rice, pasta, granola, oats, brown sugar, candy. So my camera wasn't filming. I've already filled up my rice jar and my pasta jar. Basically what I was saying is that I only have one huge jar, so rice goes in here. Then pasta went into the tinier container. I also got these like tiny little containers, so maybe granola in here. Now we're gonna do cereal. This um, Frutella candy. Basically, it's kind of like Starburst, but a little bit better. Do a little brown sugar. So we've got our jar of brown sugar, candy, cereal, pasta, breakfast oats, granola. But we're gonna put that up top. Oh my gosh, it doesn't fit. So the big jar fits in here, but it doesn't fit up there, which is a problem because I don't want the rice to be here and then like all of those to be up there, but I really want those to be up there. Got them all up there. Now we've got these little containers. We've got their airtight covers. For these containers, I wanted to peel and chop all my spring onions, garlic, um, ginger. By doing this, um, the garlic, onions, and spring onions will last me forever. It's also nice because they're gonna be like ready to go, ready to cook with. Okay, so we've got a bag of them right here. Can you handle it if I go there, baby, with you? So, we are done our spring onions. All we have to do for this one is basically peel it. And I have to leave my house at 2 and it's 1.30 right now. So I think I might save the onions and garlic for later when I get back from getting my nails done. And then we will continue. Yeah, but let's be so Um, I think this one is that too bright actually. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Oh yeah. That blue is nice. Yes. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Is that in oh the picture? Oh my god, look at this one. That was something right now. Yeah. She basically freestyled whatever I kind of like showed her. I showed her like a picture of like a bunch of like bugs, um, like colorful looking bugs, like really pretty bugs. And so this is how it came out. So yeah, it's so cute. I actually love having my nails super short um, and natural, but I am actually pretty hungry. So I'm gonna cook us, or I'm gonna cook myself a plate of dinner and I'll bring you guys along. So I wanted to 
make this Vietnamese caramel rice bowl. Pretty tiny onion. Thai chili, brown sugar. For our spinach, I have these little containers for them. So what I'm going to do, grab a little paper towel kind of tuck it in to the bottom. And then I can also put this little tray over top. There you go. Celery. Fill it with water. Just submerge it in water, kind of like our celery. Okay, so don't mind the emptiness of my fridge. I try to only shop for groceries for the week so that I avoid, you know, spoiling or, you know, things going bad. So for this week, we've got watermelon, spinach. These are mainly for my green juice, as I said, um, but I've got my spinach. I've got garlic in there. I can put that in the freezer as well, but for now, that's gonna stay in there. That's why I put like this paper towel to absorb all the moisture. And then here we've got my celery and my cucumber. I also submerged my rosemary in water. Um, I tried to Google, you know, ways to kind of preserve them because they usually go bad really quickly and I don't eat steak that often. But I also just have my oat milk, my normal milk, and then I got like kimchi and um, what's the sauce called? Um, gochujang in there. So just some sauces and then the butter. Here I have a couple more sauces. So my ketchup, my mayo. Just jam, coconut water, and then in here I just have my veggies for the week, and then just my cheese and my parmesan. So for the freezer, now I don't have a lot of space. This is mainly for ice, so it is like a little ice tray, but I also put my um, frozen mango and frozen pineapples down there as well. And then in here I have my meats, my um, spring onions, basically everything that I'm eating throughout the week, and then just my mochis. Sometimes I'm like, thank God the outfits that I plan in my head work out because if not, I'd be hella late. I feel like I was traumatized from last night from being super cold. We are gonna be walking around outside so I wanna make sure that I'm bundled up really nicely. Pretty simple today, to be honest. I didn't have time to really think of an outfit, so. But we've got like a mohair crop top underneath and then a mohair cardigan and then another mohair jacket. We're gonna meet at Apple because I do need to get my AirPods and purchase like a little adapter for my charging cable. So let's go. Sun is out today, so it's gonna be a good day. Let's do it. I bought for 16,000, the this is G5, no, this not a challenger. I keep some numbers with me in the fridge, the coat, see, space and cannibals. Tell them the outfit. Walking with you, different. She took a look, mixed it with the chill out. Now she says she's saying 3D. I go in the jungle and I'm at a Filipino restaurant. I better do this shit for the fam. They have ube 
a cheesecake. So I'm literally having Chris try them. Yes, but I didn't. Dude, his phone is like an iPhone. <laughs> like, what is it? SE? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna open TikTok. First one video is gonna go viral. They even have a Uber brownie. Man, this is like a magic, magic muffin. This with ice cream. Finally made it home. I actually got a little ube cheesecake to go. So we went to Casa and Kin. Got this bomb ube cheesecake that I can't wait to try. We also got the ube pan de sal with like cream cheese. It was so good when it was like warm. Although I love a little bit more ube. Actually got a couple of packages. Um, my shoe rack came and my clothing rack came. We're gonna have to set that up tomorrow. So I have a shoe rack and a clothing rack. I feel like my apartment is due for like an actual like cleaning day, an organizing day. I also still have this whole mess to kind of organize and my jewelry is still not organized. I might actually get rid of some of them because I know damn well I'm not going to be wearing them anymore. I got another hat because I overused the navy one. It's like a green color. I actually have to assemble it's my clothing rack. The thing I hate about opening big packages is I always have to go downstairs to actually get rid of them. Okay. I'm on the period today, but I actually got period panties from Amazon because I thought they would help to like not bleed out my sheets overnight. Hello strangers, been a minute since we last kicked it. And by the way, I just got in town And I won't let cumulus clouds all in the sky Ruin my vibe So usually I don't do this often But since recruiting So 
I actually might be able to store most of my shoes in here. Put your sweats on, put your sweats on for me. Cause I got the plug I made. I am so happy that I was able to fit all the shoes that I brought. So all my sneakers, my boots, my heels, my mules, everything is all in here. I'm gonna try to store most of my like, my big boots and coats in here. So this gives me a little bit more space in my actual closet to store more clothes because it's getting a little bit too packed in there. So, And then for here I can also hang my delicates whenever I do my laundry and I can put it out in my little patio area. Or not patio, like the terrace area. So yeah. yeah. Fuck all night, yeah. Update. We've got not really most of my things in here. I still need to buy a couple more empty trays. My goal is to have literally like everything in this drawer. Like I don't want any of my jewelry in here. I'm also taking out a bunch of these that I actually don't see myself wearing anymore. Um, so I might post them on Depop. But for now, this is all I have. I have most of my sunglasses down there and then most of my jewelry that I actually like want to wear and will wear yeah and then most of like my go-to jewelry is in my little tray by my kitchen so those are not in here um so I might actually end the vlog here and save all the cleaning for the next video so I'll do like a deep clean of my whole apartment on my next one it is also Christmas season so I'm gonna try to do as much festive stuff with all my friends this week my family is actually coming Christmas day so I will be alone till Christmas day but at least they're coming for the holidays um, and we'll spend like a very London Christmas here um, in my apartment. I'll talk to you guys in my next video.